In the previous section, we learned how to create plots for categorical variables. In this segment, we will learn how to produce a stem and leaf display using R. To demonstrate this, we will use the default R dataset chick weight in all segments of this section. For this purpose, we will need body weight of the chicks in gram when the chicks received the experimental diet 1 and 2. We create two separate variables WDT1 and WDT2 for convenience. In R, we will be using the function stem to produce the stem and leaf plot. Let us see how. At first, let us open the R script. We use the stem function on the body weight of the chicks when they receive the experimental diet 1. To find out the arguments of this function, we find the associated help file from R using help function. To adjust the plot length, we can use the scale argument. For example, when we set scale equal to 2, the number of stems increases. We can also adjust the width or length of leaf of the plot using width argument. Stem is a function from default R graphics package. Another useful package is APL pack. In this package, we can find additional functions related to stem and leaf plot. Let us first install the package. We select appropriate mirror. After installing successfully, we load the package using require function. In the new package, we can use stem.leaf function to draw the stem and leaf plot. If we need to compare two variables, we can use back to back stem and leaf display. For example, the body weight of the chicks when they received the experimental diet 1 and 2 can be compared using this function stem.leaf.backback. To construct two parallel stem and leaf displays side by side, back to back argument can be used. In summary, we can use stem function from graphics package and stem.leaf and stem.leaf.backback function from APL pack package to construct stem and leaf plots. Now you will be able to draw stem and leaf plots in R. In the next segment, we will learn how to construct a histogram.